Ferdinand Foch, 1851 to 1929, was a prominent French military commander and strategist, known for his pivotal role during World War I. Born in Tarbes, France, Foch pursued a military career early on, attending the École Polytechnique and the École de Guerre, where he became a leading advocate of the offensive strategy in warfare. His early career included various teaching positions, where he influenced a generation of French military officers with his emphasis on attack as the best form of defense. When World War I broke out in 1914, Foch initially commanded the French Ninth Army during the First Battle of the Morne, where his leadership played a crucial role in halting the German advance into France. His ability to coordinate and manage large-scale troop movements was evident, and despite initial setbacks, he was instrumental in stabilizing the front. Fokker's strategic insight and determination earned him higher command positions as the war progressed. In 1916, he was involved in the Battle of the Somme, although this battle resulted in massive casualties with limited gains. Nevertheless, Fokker's reputation as a capable and relentless leader grew. In 1918, he was appointed Supreme Commander of the Allied Forces on the Western Front, a role that placed him in charge of coordinating the military efforts of France, Britain, the United States, and other Allied powers. Foch was a key architect of the counteroffensives that ultimately pushed the German forces back, leading to the signing of the armistice on November 11, 1918. His strategic use of combined arms tactics and his insistence on maintaining pressure on the enemy were critical to the Allied victory. Foch was highly regarded for his ability to foster unity among the diverse Allied forces, ensuring coordinated and effective military operations. After the war, he was celebrated as one of the architects of the victory and was awarded numerous honors, including being made a Marshal of France, the highest military distinction in the country. Despite his military success, Foch was critical of the Treaty of Versailles, believing that it was too lenient on Germany and predicting that it would lead to future conflicts, a prophecy that proved accurate with the outbreak of World War II. Fokker's legacy is that of a brilliant strategist and a steadfast leader, whose contributions were crucial to the Allied victory in World War I. He is remembered for his emphasis on offensive strategies, his skill in coalition warfare, and his ability to inspire and coordinate the efforts of multiple nations in a time of unprecedented global conflict.